conclusion that Jarvis has, the first part is it is camera agnostic. Right. The third part, you have ready-made plug and play solutions. The another beautiful part of yours is the video wall. At any any point of time, I can have the whole glance of all the videos. I can take real-time analytics. I can take real-time you know uh, attempt. If I have more people are you know across there, I can do instant gratification. Excited with uh, Jarvis especially because uh, when I did that footfall analysis, you remember we yeah, have yeah. that gender analysis. We don't have any clue, you know, uh, you know, key, which uh, at what age because you know Raymond 40, 55 above. But now what we are seeing that young guys are also coming and buying Park Avenue. They are also buying you know Raymond suits, right? So you know, hum, you know what is the dwell time? We don't have any clue. Now we think with you guys, we'll have all those. One thing for sure, data is going to rule, that's for sure. But the next agenda of data would be the cognitive data, which is the behavioral data or the sensory data. And all three, whatever that I've told you now, will all come from video analytics. Because video is the only way of truth, where the facts are converted into data. So I'm pretty sure that video analytics is going to rule in coming future. Whether you know, whether in your uh, in my retail segment, whether in my you know hospitality segment, whether in any of the you know industry, it 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 will rule. So either we need to uh, visit now, or we need to visit in future. But we need to step into video analytics.